Hey guys, Jacob and Esther here, and today we're going to be looking at a brand new subscription box. It is the nom 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 box. Actually, just the om nom, but that was more fun. When you open the box, it has it has these cute little eye stickers that uh you can't see it. Ooh, this one packed a lot of goodies. Okay, we're gonna go with the first one. It is Ramune. Bottle. Wait, this is interesting. I've never seen a can. I've always seen the bottle version where you have to break it from the top. Yeah. Um, if you've never had it, there's like... There's a marble this, inside. Yeah, there's a marble inside. And people like to break the bottle to get the marble out, which is not super safe, but that's what people like to do. Ah! No, it's... No marble? No marble. Maybe they stopped doing the marble because it was unsafe. I really like the flavor because it's not too sweet. Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's a slight a hint it's of It's just sweet. enough. Just enough. Just enough sweet. Okay, we have the Meiji Carl Chizuaji Japanese Corn Puffs, basically. Japanese Corn Puffs. Next up, we have the Cute Strawberry Panda. Oh, these are like the ones that you made. Yeah. Remember? Wow. Tastes like the um, strawberry puppy. Mm -hmm. Now we have the I May wafers. These are Taiwanese wafers and two different flavors of them. Blue one is a sweet vanilla flavor, and the second is more adventurous. It's taro, which isn't that adventurous if you're Asian. The taro kind. Can you taste the taro? I don't really taste the taro. I feel like it, it just is too sweet. And now we have the pretz salad. So I guess this is salad flavored steak. Which I wonder what kind of dressing it's going to be or if it just tastes like veggies. Coffee. Next up we have strawberry jelly cubes. They look like jello. Oh, is there paper on it? Oh, maybe it's a rice paper. Yeah, rice paper. Ah, mm. It's good, it tastes like jello. Harder jello. We have Pleco sticks! We tried something similar to this, but a bigger one, I think. It's like an ice cream, ice cream cone. Miniature ice cream cone. When you bite into it, they have these little airy pockets. Air bubbles. Air bubbles. We have Hello Kitty Ramyun candy. I think they whistle. Oh, they are whistlers. When our cats hear really high-pitched noises, they go nuts and they start fighting each other. I think it's kind of mean, but it's really amusing. Puka cream pretzels! I don't know what puka cream is. It looks like... Yeah, you open it from the side. There's a little tab right here. Oh, it's easy to share. They look like goldfish, kind of. Mine looks like a pineapple. Ooh. Chocolate. Moranaga chocolate ball. Okay, you're supposed to open it chocolate like ball. sideways like this. Chocolate ball. Let's see if I can make it actually. <laughs> Did I really tell you? <laughs> I did it. You did it. You did it so hard. You threw it right at my... Whatever that hangy thing is called. Oh, this is super exciting. We have oven baked creme brulee Kit Kat. 
So for any of you guys who follow us, uh, Esther and her friends have a Kit Kat club where they all try all these crazy Japanese flavor Kit Kats. I don't know why they don't sell them here, but they have the most amazing flavors, like like blueberry cheesecake and six, creme brulee, creme brulee, and six different kinds of strawberries and, and what, green tea. And what's cool about this one is you oven, oh, you put it in the toaster oven, and then it brings out the flavor. So I'm probably going to eat one regular and bake one. So that's it for our Om Nom box. Check it out over here, and also be sure to subscribe. We will see you guys later.